What's going on guys, I'm Mystic and welcome to another video, and this one guys, I'm going to be ranking every single Call of Duty Zombies song Treyarch only, from worst to best. This is, a go this is only going to be the ones that you can activate in game, so it's nothing like the theatrical mixes, and it's only going to be the ones that Treyarch made, and not like the Eminem or Event Sevenfold or Jack Wall. It's only going to be the Treyarch made ones, so with no further ado guys, let's go ahead and get started. And in the very last place, guys, I have We All Fall Down, which is the Die Rise Easter Egg song sung by Clark Nova. I just can't stand this song. Like, it is terrible. Like, like I've only heard it a couple times, but, like, each time I just dislike it more, so... I don't know. Next up is Undone, which this song isn't necessarily bad, I just can't like it. Like, it's the Nocturne Tote and Easter Egg song, and the reason I don't like it is because it's only guitar, there's no vocals in it, which I'm more of a vocal guy myself, unless it's the Wolfenstein 2 soundtrack, which I love, by the way. But, like, to activate the song, all you had to do is, like, hold X slash square slash F on a radio, and then you will activate it. It's an easy song to activate. But, however, it's... it's not that good. Coming up next, guys, I have Coming Home from Moon. This is sung by Alina Siegmund. But, guys, Coming Home, it's a Screamo song by Alina Siegmund. Almost the entire thing is Screamo. All that is not Screamo, in fact, are the choruses and a little bit of a verse. But that's the only part that's not Screamo. Which, like, I'm not a Screamo guy myself, so I just don't like it that much. But, you know, just, you know I, I, I won't yuck on other people's yum. Next up, guys, is Cold Hard Cash from Shadows of Evil, sung by Antonia Bennett, if I remember correctly. I don't remember the name that well. I just, I had to get the name for the video, and I've got a paper right here, but I didn't write down the artist's name, sadly. But this is a Shadows of Evil second Easter egg song, and you get this one by finding a microphone stand, a microphone, and something else, I forget what. And then you just take it up to the boutique, I mean not the boutique, the uh, the club, I forget what it's called, and it plays, so. This is a good song though, so like, the rest of these songs aren't, aren't necessarily bad, they're just low tier good. Like, those first two, like, first three songs I had mentioned, We All Fall Down, Undone, and Coming Home, those are bad. But these ones are actually good, so, let's keep going. At this spot, guys, we have Ether from Origins by Treyarch Sound. There's no singing on this one, but however, it's actually good. So you get this one by activating the 115 on Origins. I'm not talking about the green rocks, I'm talking the generators. You go prone on the one at generator one, hold X. Then the other side, hold X. And then generator five, hold X on the five. And then it'll play, and it's just really good. And... If you haven't listened to it already, here's a little snippet as I'm doing with the rest of the songs. <laughs> Coming up. 
coming up at the next spot, I gotta come up with a different transition words. It's gonna be the Beauty of Annihilation remix. So, this song is on the Giant, which it doesn't quite live up to its predecessor from Doris. Which, don't worry guys, it's I'm ranking all of them, so it's on the list too. But it doesn't quite live up to its predecessor. And that's not necessarily a bad thing, because the song is still good. Like, I was going to put it in my Spotify playlist, but I couldn't find it anywhere, so... You want to get that up there, Treyarch, if you watch this video? Probably not. Coming up next, guys, is Dead Flowers, and this is the Zetsubo no Shima song, which Zetsubo no Shima is bad, but this is a good thing that came from it. Keep that in mind. This song, I just like the guitar and the how Maluka is on it. Coming up next, guys, is Carry On. This is the Transit Easter Egg song. Transit more like trans shit. I know, I've heard the joke before. But this is probably the only good thing to come out of Transit. And in case you haven't heard it, guys, it's actually really good. It's not one of those screamo songs. It's a song by Clark S. Nova, which he does do screaming in a couple songs, but we'll put that aside for this one because he doesn't scream. And, uh,. If you haven't heard it yet, I definitely recommend you listen to the whole thing, which that that's from this point on. I recommend you listen to the whole thing because chances are you haven't. Like a dream where I'm falling and calling out my resistance is silent. I can feel but I still can't control myself. Please forgive me. Coming up next guys is Archangel from Origins, sung by not just Alina Siegman. Not just Alina Sigmund and Maluka, but Alina Sigmund, Maluka, and Clark S. Nova. There's a uh, Alina Sigmund singing most of it, Maluka doing the ooze, and Clark S. Nova screaming at some points. So this song is very good, which this is like medium tier levels now. So it's good, trust me. It's it, it's quite long though, so make sure you have enough time to listen to it. It's like six minutes long, I think. There's another one on this list that is too, but yeah. Coming up next, guys, is a lullaby from a dead man from Verrucht. And to activate this one, you gotta activate the toilets three times. I've just spat everywhere. But then once you do that, it'll start playing. And this is from, this is from the second ever Zombies map, so it's pre this is pretty good quality. And it's a good song, too. Like I used to be able to play it on piano all the way, but I forgot how to play it, so yeah. Next up is Dead Again from Der Eisendrach, and this song is sung by Alina Siegman as well as Lullaby for Dead Man. In fact, almost every song on here is sung by Alina Siegman because that's that's the easiest one to get a hold to a hold of apparently. To activate this song, you gotta activate the teddy bears, and I don't know why I'm telling you how to activate them. That's how you activate every song almost. But this song has a very good guitar style from Kevin Sherwood, and Der Eisendrach's a good map overall, so this song's good too. That does it really mean that, but you, you know what I mean.
Next up is Always Running. This is the Buried Easter Egg song, and it is sung by Maluka. Now, this song is... <clears throat> we're getting to the high tier now, which... God tier isn't for a couple more... A, a couple more. But this song is high tier, in my opinion. This is where we start the high tier level, okay? Always Running is long. It's the other long song on this list. But it is worth it. Trust me. The only complaint I have about it is the length. Like... It just fits so well on the map. Buried's the best map, don't at me. But it, even though it's not the fan favorite map, it's not my favorite map, but it is the best map. I'll explain it in a video. But I don't really have much to say about it, so I'm just going to go to the next one. Next up we have Abracadabra from Ascension. Now, another high tier song. This one does have a little bit of screaming in it though, but it makes up for it for the incredible vocals, which... Can you guys tell I don't like screamo music yet? Okay, good. This song is a beast, and I'm not gonna say how you activate it, but it's also long. I forgot that it was long, so this is the third long song on this list. Hold up. Okay, there's one other long song on this list, and it's coming up in a, like, next, actually. That's, that's weird. But it's from, I mean, I don't really have much to say about the songs, because they're songs, so I'm just gonna breeze through the rest of them, okay? Coming up next, we've got a Dead Ended from Gorod Krovi, and it is sung by Clark S. Nova. Now... <laughs> in this... But it sounds good. Like, I, I completely screamed at this song at one point, I'm pretty sure. Like, last year I did a, a live stream where I was screaming lot of zombie songs, which if you want to see this, let's get this video to a good amount of likes. I don't know how, how well this video is going to do. But, let's just set it 25 likes, because, I don't know. I don't want to do another one of those. But 25 likes and I'll do another Screaming Zombie Songs live stream. But we're almost at the end of the high tier songs now, and it's starting off in two places is where we get to the god tier songs. Coming up next, guys, we have The Gift from Revelation, sung by Alina Siegman. This is the most recent song that we have gotten from Treyarch, slash Kevin Sherwood. And it's, it's, God, this is, this is after this is where God tier starts, guys. I'm just, I'm just gonna let you know. So, everything after this, I'm like, I would listen to this any day. Like, if you put it on, I'd be like, oh my god, that's my jam. But, The Gift is... Like, she hits incredibly high notes in it, and it's just really impressive, and that's what makes it so good. And the, and the guitar on it is also very good. It's got really good drums, which I just, I just love this song. Like, it's so good. And now guys, we get, we are getting into the god tier category. 
Uh, why did I do that voice? I have no idea. Will I ever do it again? Probably not. Hopefully. But this is going to be Where Are We Going from Mob of the Dead, sung by Maluka. So, this song is the shortest song, I'm pretty sure. It's like 2 minutes and 25 seconds, if I remember correctly. I have it on my Google Play. But, like, great map, and it's a great song. Like, what more could you ask for? This is a god tier song, in my opinion, so. Like, Maluka's voice in this track is awesome. Like, oh my god, it's just so good. Coming up next, guys, we have 115. This is from Kino der Toten, and now you're probably at this point thinking, wait, how is Kino number three? What other two songs are there? Hold your horses there, pal. So basically, guys, 115, it's, it's God tier as well. And I would consider this to be very good, obviously. Why would I even say that? But this has a little bit of screaming in it, but it makes up for it with the great track. What am I saying? The guitar, I love the guitar and the drum combination on this. Like, it just works really well. And I used, and I can still play it on piano mostly, so that works out. Now, this is the one that might confuse some of you, and that's because you probably never heard before, but this is going to be the one from Shino Numa. I, I don't know many people that actually know this song that well. Like, if you actually listen to it, it's a really good song. Like, I'll play my favorite part from the snippet. Well, in the snippet, but, I mean, this song is awesome. Like, if you don't like this song, then you probably like Gucci Gang. And finally, guys, number one spot, you, you, you saw it coming, it's Beauty of Annihilation. And, like, this song is a masterpiece, it's, like, four minutes long, I think, so it's not too long, but it is kind of long. It's, it's no six-minute song, like three other songs on this list, but it, it, had, it has a little bit of screaming in it, but it's not much, so it, that's how it makes up for it, I guess, you know? But, like, the song is from Darice, sung by... Alina Sigmund, as well as 115 in the 1. I keep forgetting to say that Alina Sigmund sings them, because, like, she sings so many. But, like, you gotta be a psycho if you do not like this song, because it is so good, and I can play it on piano. And if you'd like to see that, I will do a live stream where I play some songs on piano. But anyway guys, that is going to be today's video. If you did enjoy it, then be sure to leave a like and check out some of my other videos. If you like those, then subscribe. I'm not gonna make I'm not gonna ask you to subscribe off of one video. That doesn't make sense to me. You gotta watch multiple. You're like, yeah, I could watch a bunch of this. Then subscribe. Anyway guys, I'm Misk. Goodbye.